Hello everybody and welcome to Ancient Architects. Please subscribe now to get the latest ancient history news and independent research from around the world. Gebekli Tepe pushes the history of ancient Anatolia back thousands of years in what is arguably the greatest archaeological discovery of all time. An enormous ancient ruin with huge T-shaped pillars, elaborately carved with animal motifs, that dates back to the 10th millennium BC. It pushes back the Neolithic origins of the region thousands of years, but the site is just the tip of the iceberg. There are many other archaeological Tepe sites in Turkey, and in this video we are looking at the new discoveries at Kahin Tepe, a site that experts think had links to Gebekli Tepe. Kahin Tepe is located in the province of Kastamonu, not far from the Black Sea, and researchers from the Kastamonu Museum Directorate of the Ministry of Culture and Tourism have been working the site for the past few years. On the ground there are archaeologists and students undertaking a rescue project, before the planned construction of a dam, a project that will destroy any undiscovered archaeology in the region. The fact that a modern dam is allowed to be constructed in such an ancient and little known landscape really does baffle me. How can this be allowed to happen? I know humans have a history of destruction and rebuilding, and also changing the landscape in the name of progress, but we are only just discovering the lives of our post Ice Age ancestors in this part of the world. Ancestors that were clearly far more advanced than we ever thought possible. There is no chance the dam project will be stopped, so I guess we should at least be grateful for the archaeological work being conducted, but it does all feel somewhat sad. So, what do we know about Kahin Tepe? Well, it's an aceramic Neolithic settlement that dates back to between 7,000 and 12,000 years ago, making it just as ancient as Gebekli Tepe. It was inhabited by a Stone Age Anatolian people, and during the 2019 season, a grinding stone and a number of personal ornaments were discovered. They even found the remains of a stone workshop, believed to have been used in the production of animal sculptures. Recent excavations have uncovered even more, and archaeologists have found the remains of what they believe to be an ancient place of worship, a temple, located at the top of a hill. These remains consist of carefully planned circular and square stone walls. Talking to the media, the experts believe it's the oldest place of worship ever discovered in the Black Sea area. Dr. Napuri Ayengin said, We think that this was a sacred area where people came at certain times of the year to hunt, share knowledge, worship and make statues of animals. Experts believe that the finds suggest that gods in the form of animals were worshipped at the site. The temple was built in a strategic location, a place that dominates the plain, and is likely to have therefore been chosen specifically and consciously. There was also a regular water supply, which means the inhabitants were able to produce a food surplus, which was crucial in the development and longevity of the site. Finds from Kahin Tepe are very similar to those at Gebekli Tepe, and experts have dated the oldest to between 9,000 and 14,000 years ago. As well as Kahin and Gebekli Tepe, there are several more prehistoric temple sites and settlements in the area, and experts believe they all show a rigid yet complex religious belief. They believe that Kahin and Gebekli Tepe were also linked, in contact with one another, and that they also influenced each other. This would imply that Neolithic societies were far more sophisticated than is often believed. Dr. Ayengin believes that this new discovery will change the history of Anatolia, but I have to ask how much of this important archaeology still remains below ground, and how much will be lost forever with the building of the new dam. Thank you very much for watching this news update from Ancient Architects. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel. Please like the video and please leave a comment below. Thank you very much.